Good evening guys, the farmer and trader here and dito naman po ako para magbigay ng uh, insights para next week. So, my top picks for next week will be uh, San Miguel Corporation, SMC, uh, and uh, EI Corporation. Third one will be Shell Philippines. Fourth one will be Now Corporation. And the fifth will be the Chelsea Logistics. So, uh, to start things up, uh, I, I picked this uh, stocks because it's one of the top performing uh, companies last week. So uh, either may may nakita ako sa mga indicators nila na parang yung pataas yung uptrend yung uh, galawan na. So we will uh, discuss first SMC. So, as we know, SMC, the one of the biggest company in the Philippines, they are more on uh, um, food production uh, as well as construction. So, uh, Skyway 3, uh, it was open lately. So, expect na SMC stock will keep up. And then, second one, they are more on infrastructure. Third one, uh, vaccines are coming. They, they are the one, uh, ano yan, isa sila sa mga companies na nagdo-donate sa government natin. So, expect na uptrend sila or uptrend yung SMC natin this coming week. So, uh, that's it. SMI O Cross with the SM, uh, SMC uh, second one second pick EEI Corporation which is involved also on construction so sabi nga nila mining is done uh, exploration is done uh, telco is sleeping and we are now on uh, maybe construction so uh, EI Corporation SMI, SMIO Cross Rising above zero So possible It will gap up again Pero as we saw the uh, EI has Five consecutive green candles So maybe maybe We will see A, uh, a little pullback uh, Just a healthy pullback uh, Yung ganun na mga time yun yung time na dapat pumasok tayo. If uh, masustain niya yung bullishness niya, uh, better to ride with it. So, third one, Shell Philippines. Shell Philippines, uh, kung matatandaan natin, nag-close sila ng refinery, pero they did not abandon the listing. Uh, now, the Shell Philippines bet on uh, power generation so uh, again this coming week we are also on uh, power generation specifically renewable energy so uh, Shell Philippines uh, there is a great rejection in the Como cloud uh, for me I'm using the uh, Ichimoku cloud with SMIO and RSI so also SMIO cross uh, indicates that it's on an uptrend uh, yung pataas yung uh, ano yung action niya so 4 to 1 will be now corporation so I pick this even if uh, it's not that the SMIO did not cross yet why? because uh, as we say said an earlier we are entering the telco uh here. So, nasa baba na siya, yung RSI niya, bounce at 30. So, I think it will keep up uh, uptrend within the next two weeks. And, uh, yun na nga, catch, catch the stock when uh, it's on the deep. Uh, okay, fifth one, Chelsea. Chelsea is the mother company of uh, listed company, uh, mother listed company of uh, Dito and Udena. 
So they have a new tanker which can carry about uh, 1,099 tons and uh, it's pretty big and uh, it's it's more useful you know uh, you know it will it will generate more uh, income to the company so SMIO uh, is about to cross cross and uh, every time Dito is going up chassis should go up also so remember that always and uh, this will be this this these are the fifth um, top pick so but uh, uh, on my own opinion I will bet more on the first three companies that I've uh, discussed which is the SMC EI and the Shell Philippines uh, for me it's uh, on an uptrend very uptrend uh, action so enough with the insights and uh, for this video i will point out uh, the, the 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 week before what happened with uh, i think every 90 percent of the stocks went down a major major pullback two consecutive days of red candle a very deep red candle our top picks like uh, ABBA, AR, OPM and OV went down it wiped out yun ang sabi natin 50 two, two consecutive days of ceiling that's it that's 50% uh, and two consecutive days of flooring which is 30% the good thing was uh, you if you catch this uh, stocks on the very bottom before it went ceiling it's a win-win situation why the two consecutive days you have a uh, total of 100% gain and then the flooring is only 30% so you should still have a better gain than nothing right so 30 30 ceiling it's um it's it's if you did not uh, cut loss pero kung nag cut loss kayo uh, buti na lang kung ganun uh, what i did was uh, on the top i took the 50 percent and then i hold the 50 percent you know why this kung sinasabi nga natin na basura ito uh, there's no such thing as basura uh, it's just a cheap stock uh, which is not being uh, hindi nakikita ng mga traders or ng mga investor or yung normal ah, yung, yung, yung tayo yung mass public hindi naman dun sa mga big fish na alam nila kung anong kalidad ng mga mga corporation so you need just to study and plan your trade uh, for for ABBA AR o, OV OPM what I saw in the weekly uh, time frame it's going up it already bounced and uh, AR especially AR uh, last Friday it has a 5 billion volume uh, of unserved uh, what do you call this yung bids so most probably this week it will go up and we are hoping it will go up and lastly uh, yun sa mga nagsasabi na huwag kayong makinig sa mga nagbibigay ng tips this is the just, just look at the brighter side those people who are giving their opinions they do it free it's up to you to take the recommendation but uh, just know your capabilities know where to enter and know you should know where to go out so hindi naman kayo nagbabayad sa, kanya, sa kanila so don't blame them just take the recommendation study it and uh, know your naman na umaakyat yung stocks alam naman natin
buy and below view up buy and pull back in so that's it for this week uh, happy weekend and i think next week will be a nice week either uh, maganda or 